Just be counting my blessings Cause I'm a space kid astronaut Whether or not I'm gon' pass you It's not the question I'm asking I'm asking when I get drafted Making music till they asking like Boosie Passing all these women like Drew Brees Get up on my hoopty I'm loyal to my city Now like Katie on some new teams I put out for my family Cause we hanging out like shoestrings Change my habits up And now it's feeling like a movie What's going on guys? Welcome to another video Today I wanna talk about an awesome topic That you guys, you know ask me all the time you're like Noah what's if I had to buy one rod what would it be or Noah what's the best all-around fishing rod or what's the best fishing rod out there and to be honest with you I made this video a couple of times over the past years but every single one gets better and more detailed on why I picked this certain rod and the reason why I would own like 10 of these out of 15 of my rods it's just because they're so versatile so i'm not going to be basing this off of any particular brand but this one is actually the fate black by 13 fishing and you guys have been asking me about this rod this rod right here i mean it's bright it's bright now this this is my color green's my color guys this, this is just all around a sick looking rod I, I honestly love it and um at first i didn't use them as much and as i've started to travel around to these ponds and during the tournaments and uh, and such as I've got to experiment with these rods a lot more They're honestly awesome guys for the price range. It's absolutely amazing If you want to go check them out go check them out at 13 fishing.com um, But overall these are some awesome rods everyone's been asking me like how do I like the fate blacks and uh, So far, you know absolutely amazing. No complaints whatsoever um, Haven't broken you haven't had anything crazy happen No eyelids the eyelids are perfectly fine and all around great inexpensive rod that we can all afford so that's that's always a big key so going on to what rod is the best all-around rod for everyday fishing so say you only had the budget to buy a few rods you only have the budget to buy one rod matter of fact but you want to be very versatile so you want to you want to be able to throw a little squareable crankbait you want to be able to throw a chatterbait you want to be able to throw a spinner bait. You want to be able to throw a Texas rig crawl. You want to be able to throw a little jig. You want to be able to throw a shaky head. Well, guess what? This is the rod right here that you guys will need. So this one in particular is a 7.3 medium heavy fast. So you got that tip, but you still got that backbone. All right. It's not going to be no flimsy like a, like a medium, medium light rod. I mean, you got your medium heavy. You got your fast tip. Very, it's still got the backbone. And this, this is my all-around favorite rod. Um, some of the other brands I've fooled and played with, um, like I used a 7-foot medium heavy, and that rod was absolutely amazing as well. So anywhere between 7-foot and 7.3 medium heavy fast action. Those are all-around, in my opinion, my favorite rod. And like I said, I mean, out of all the rods I own, I got a lot of new rods from 13 Fishing, like 25 rods, and... A big 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 majority big percentage of those rods are around seven foot to seven three medium heavies and the reason is because they're so versatile guys you could literally throw anything on this as you can tell I have just a little swim bait on this one right here you can literally throw almost any baits on this I mean you're not gonna be wanting to go chuck a three-quarter ounce or one ounce jig on this rod you're just not but if you're gonna you're, you have a little 316 ounce jig and you're wanting to throw that around uh, some docks or a little shaky head or um, like I said, like a spinnerbait, God, it's perfect. I actually, before I had this little swim bait on, I tied a spinnerbait on it, and I was, I was very amazed. Um, also, a chatterbait, awesome, worked perfectly on this rod. You know, you have that tip. I, me personally, this is my personal preference. A lot of people want to fade towards a heavier rod, but me and my personal preference, I, I don't tend to like a heavier rod. I like something that's going to have a little bit of the tip, and it's also going to have the backbone. And the reason I like the tip so much is because... On a heavy rod, I tend, me personally, I don't have as much accuracy. Me personally. You, you guys are going to have to go experiment on your own. But all around, I, I really believe a medium heavy, fast, around 7 foot, is perfect for you. Perfect for everyone, in my opinion. But um, so accurate. See, when you're swinging that rod, that tip with that bait, I mean, that rod's just bending perfectly. I get a lot of accuracy. When I'm skipping docks, I don't like to use a big old heavy meat stick. I, I just, I don't like that. And of course you're not going to use no medium rod, it's a big old flimsy rod, you're not going to puncture the hook through the fish. So, medium heavy is just perfect. If I'm skipping some docks, I'm skipping a little jig up under there, oh my god, just tipping everything on that rod, I can just get that bait wherever I want. I know this sounds insane, but you can give me a 7.3 medium heavy, and I can go skip docks, and literally wherever you want me to skip this jig, I'm going to be able to put that jig, like, all the way up, skip it all the way to the back, boom, I got it. 
if you gave me like a 7.6 heavy and told me to do the same thing, I would not nearly be as accurate as I was with the 7.3 medium heavy. It's uh, literally, it's a crazy difference, at least to me. And um, I think it's all around great rod. But like I said, if you want to go check these out, Fade Blacks by 13 Fishing, go check them out. All around awesome rod, guys. But like I said, seven foot to seven three, medium heavy, fast, extra fast, personal preference on the tip, whatever you guys like. If you guys wanna one if you guys are wondering about a reel, any like seven one to one gear ratio reels, any seven three to one gear ratio reels, anything in a seven seven range, because that's more the moderate. You know, if you get like a five one, five one to one gear ratio reel, it's more for cranking. If you, uh, you can get a six six gear ratio reel or a seven, then you got the eights, they're super fast. Um, I, I tend to stick towards like the seven three to one gear ratio reels, all around great combo. Um, but overall guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. You guys have been asking me about the Fade Blacks, so I just told you about that right here. And also about my favorite all around rod, if I could only layer it down to buying one rod, what would it be and what um, actions and length and power and everything so thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this video hit the thumbs up button hope you guys are grinding every single day hope you guys are striving to be the best that you can be and taking over this world with me and just putting forth 150 percent effort towards everything in life guys i think it's so important and the people that i'm inspiring and the reason i know i'm touching so many of you guys is because i've had handfuls of personal friends come up to me and say noah like Dude, every single time I like listen to you talk about this and see you putting on this work towards something and talking about, you know, grinding towards and grinding towards your goal. And they're all coming up to me saying, you know, that's really inspiring me. And I know if my friends or personal friends that know me as just Noah are coming up and saying that to me, I know you guys are getting something out of it as well. But if you guys haven't checked out the, this past week's videos, Sunday's video, Thursday's video, Tuesday's video, Go check those out. Also, I have a new video coming out Thursday and Sunday, 11 a.m. Eastern time. That's my standard times. Like I said, I post Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday. But overall, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Just be counting my blessings. Cause I'm a space kid astronaut. Whether or not I'm going past you is not the question I'm asking. I'm asking when I get drafted. Making music till they asking like, who is she? Passing all these women like Drew Brees. Get up on my hoop tee. I'm loyal to my city, not like Katie on some new teams. I put out for my family, cause we hanging on like shoestrings. Changed my habits up, and now it's feeling like a mood ring. Now it's feeling like a mood ring.